Hello, friends today I'll show you about the difference between monopolar and bipolar diathermy. In this video, you're going to learn, what is diathermy? Types of diathermy. Difference between monopolar and bipolar diathermy. Let's get on to the video. Let's know what is diathermy first. Diathermy is electrically induced heat used to cut or coagulate tissue during surgery. It allows for precise incisions to be made with limited blood loss and is now used in nearly all surgical procedures. Two types of diathermy are commonly used in surgical procedures. We will see the difference between them. One is monopolar diathermy. Another one is bipolar diathermy. Monopolar diathermy is looking like a pen. Whereas bipolar diathermy looks like prongs. In monopolar, earth plate is used to receive the current. For bipolar no need to use earth plate because it has a receiver end. Monopolar diathermy performs both cut and coagulation. But, bipolar performs only coagulation. In monopolar, the current comes from the tip and ends in the earth plate. In bipolar, the current comes from one paddle and goes via another paddle. Current spread deeply so it is not used near the vital organs. Current spreads locally. These are some of the difference between monopolar and bipolar diathermy. I'll add some important points regarding monopolar diathermy. There are two buttons in the monopolar diathermy. One looks in yellow used to cut. It has a low voltage continuous current. Another looks in blue used for coagulation. It has a high voltage alternative current. Monopolar diathermy doesn't work without connecting an earth plate. And the earth plate must be in the wide area of skin which has increased blood flow and reduce hair on it. Don't use the pad again and again because the adhesive goes away after using multiple times. If it is improperly placed or attached can cause burns. Monopolar diathermy also interferes with cardiac induction. It must be avoided in the person with cardiac pacemakers. Due to the high conduction of current, it causes thermal damage to nerves and structures. So it is not used in the place of vital nerves. That's all for today. I hope you understood this topic. If you have any doubts or suggestions post it on the comment box. Subscribe to our channel to get more interesting videos regarding anesthesia. Thanks for watching.